So in the Travel X series, Holly is dancing around. Uh oh, she bought a whole bunch of snacks and I ended up getting a shirt for an event I'm going to. And uh, now she's a star of the show. We have no breaks in this music. So in the Travel X series, she's dancing like this up tomorrow to get away from her problems. <laughs> so do you think you're a star? Sure I am. She, looks, she has foreign qualities because she lived in your room before. I was kicked out of a copy place because we think I need more practice on stage. <laughs> so one experience I had, I went to a flappers and I went to somewhere else. And you didn't the end of the road. And in the Travel X series, she's <laughs> <acting> sort of pliable. <laughs> of course, we're all furries in our own way. <laughs> so in the Travel X series, um, do you have anything good to say? Uh, oh, oh, what happened today that was funny? Good to say. Yeah. Well, uh, did anything funny happen today at work? Um, no, it was really boring. I tried to call you, but you thought, uh, oh, I'll just call her later. It was just me. You, was your phone by you when I tried to call you? Uh, yeah. You're trying to answer I try to keep my phone on me all the time so that. I can... In case you have to babysit Jamie? No, oh, just in case my dad calls. I jumped out of the shower thinking, she's going to feed her dad. Meanwhile, I need to be fed. And I, I, I came out of the shower thinking that. I was like, I'm like a little baby. I need to be fed. <laughs> I was thinking, that's a stupid thing. Again? What'd you do, honey? Did you rent the mall so I could dance around? <laughs> now you think it's empty like uh, most of the men's minds with me. <laughs> I keep thinking she's being herself finally. So I got two shirts and the red one looks really nice. You know, a lot of people tune into Facebook because when they're, they're like living zombies, I'm not kidding you. <laughs> My dad was read a log of the zombie world. He used to say that. He tuned in. I had four to six people looking at the footage of how you and I acting funny at my event. Oh, yeah? Yeah. All right, so we're going to make it around. We're going to get pumpkin in here. It's like it was made for me. This bag, this bag I love it. How much is that? I don't know. The tag was going that way. So in the Trail and X series, she just gave him a free fucking ID at the telephone company. So it's kind of funny. So she gave him a free ID. In the Trail and X series, if you become a stripper, then you can say, excuse me, you'll be working it up. And then while you work it up, I'm, I'm filming myself. So if he becomes a stripper, he could afford that tablet he was trying to sell. So his eyebrows are going up now. <laughs> Take care. Okay, bye-bye. Okay, <laughs> so in the Traveling X series, I can't believe what I told him. In the Traveling X series, I told him if he becomes a stripper, he could afford that tablet. And his eyebrows. You just gave him a free idea, Holly. I do that all the time. And I, I, I hope, have it. I hope and I expect people to be honest in the world and do the right thing and give me my 10%. Now, so far, I don't have very many people have done that for me. You tell me series, I had sugar in that whole... But I do, I have like 10 ideas right now that are fantastic for bettering the world. And I can't find the, the, the one person that I can totally trust. She's giving away free ideas. Well, no, it's not free, because I want 10%. <laughs> I want residual, <laughs> residual income. You tell me series. You know what I mean? For everything, every sale, I want... I want my 10%. She just gave that guy an idea and I gave him an idea too. I said, just think you could become a stripper. <laughs> and mm -hmm. I follow it up. <laughs> he claims he can't afford it. So, in the Travel X series, it's the anti-social world. People are just texting away like zombies. Land. Let me tell you why. Well, let's go for a ride. Excuse me. I, I was thinking, since, since we both have a lot of anger in us, I think we should pick a boxing class together. But I'm afraid someone might ruin my face and punch me out on my face. I just don't want to ruin my face. It's like, as long as it's the arm and stuff. I want to do that because um, my upper body needs working well, out. Like, my should... lower body's... I don't eat that kind of pie, sorry. The question is, how come we have this anger inside of the world? I'm, I'm, I'm angry because um, uh, I'm mad at the world, like my nephew said, when he was two years old. <laughs> Yeah. Oh really? My nephew said he was he mad at the world. He cursed you. He cursed you. 